Hi, it's Trub recording here. I'm gonna show you how to create some kind of Swiss cheese effect in Houdini using VDB. So I create a cube of a size of 5, then I translate it in Y 2.5 just to sit it on the floor. <clears throat> and then uh, I enter the box object, I will convert it to fog using VDB VDB from poly shift enter will plug it automatically then uh, <clears throat> I check the fog checkbox here and check the distance VDB I leave the voxel size 2.1 which is quite big but I will uh, see it updating in the viewport. I can set it to 1. <clears throat> and then I will carve this fog using a volume VOP. In the volume VOP I'm gonna add a unified noise. It will plug inside in the position and output to the density. Oop. I will add to this a uh, fit range just to adjust the range. I will set here the amplitude to 0.5. I will copy the, this parameter in Y and Z. Oop. Copy relative reference so I can change only that one and the two others will follow. I set it to 0.5 and set my fit range to a max destination of 10 and my, yeah, don't forget my noise, I will set it to Worley. Convert the fog to VDB. Uh, no, not that one. It's VDB convert. Convert VDB. Boop. Here, and I will set it to uh, VDB fog to SDF because I want to use the VDB smooth SDF. Then I will convert this to polygon by using a VDB, a convert VDB, like this convert VDB to polygon. And I'm gonna set this to smooth shaded, and then I can increase the resolution by reducing the voxel size and you can see the effect of the noise carving a mesh and this noise is really 3D you can go inside that cube with the camera and see the inside And then I can play with the here the the noise amplitude. If I set it to point four, the holes would get bigger. I can lower the fre the frequency a bit to point eight maybe. So I have a bit less of those like uh, maybe a little more like a real cheese and then if I want it to look uh, more like a cheese I can change the shape here get back to the cube select some point here Point. Where are the point? No. The box. Okay. <laughs> I didn't 
select the node. Toop. So I can move those point. Like this. Toop. Looks a bit like a cheese. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> I have some bending here from the VDB process. I can play with the here the, the smooth SDF settings. If I do Gaussian and I can increase the the voxel, I can reduce the voxel size to increase resolution. If I render this, generating scene, rendering, render in seven seconds, not so bad. I will play with this setting here to get maybe some sharper hole, but I get some bending, so. the iterations you can see I, I changed the setting and the rendering updates quite fast so that's it <laughs> So for the rest, it's just a matter of adjusting the settings to get a nicer surface. So thanks for watching.